listening to Jenny and John are so moving for me because they and Leanne came to our home. Our living room became the kiva and we practiced together. But what happened in that time is that the level of love and healthy connection and space between us, we gave each other enough space. And there was a capacity of love and a feeling of family. And it was as though we were a healthy family. It was like the rebirth of family creation. My life project was going to be how to live and how to die. Because when I was at the last retreat, what came to me was dying to live and living to die. So I had these lofty ideas about creating a book. And after Jenny and John and Leanne left, it was kind of like Luke watching the energy go and realizing what love and energy was given in authenticity. And then it was just John and I, and it felt like a thud. And I realized that I'm so willing to give love out to the world and other people. And then it was time to treat John, my beloved, as my best friend that he is, to make the home beautiful for each other and for ourselves and to give to each other and our life the same kind of gifts that we gave to our beloved guests. And so that's become my life project. And instead of dying to live and have a desperation of what I have to do to do it right, practice three hours every day, open my heart, feel my own pain, and not project my partner as the reason I'm feeling pain. And in this retreat, I really felt my strength Oh, my strength and how much I love life. And that's my driving force is to be alive. And I'm so grateful for it. And now I can feel that I embrace my pain as much as my joy. And I made a devotion to myself that I will be with myself in every moment and embrace it all. And to know that I will be there with me through all of it. And I know me, me better than anyone else. And nobody else can love me as much as I love and know myself. And yet all of what I get here and all of everyone's pain and suffering and letting go and putting it down feeds the earth and each other. And Master Ming Tongu such skill and love for life and joy and a model of how to live and your devotion to this path. 
And for me too, this is what my life is till I die. And onward, eternally. <laughs>